Well, indeed, Byron. That one didn't want to make friends with us, and so now we've decided to go for a much taller, bigger version with spots all over it. And we found one of the most beautiful male giraffe that we have in this area. He is dark, dark, dark. Look at him. He's almost black in color. And very, very pretty indeed. And at the moment, at least, he's the only animal that's cooperating and actually standing still this afternoon and not moving away from us. So we can be thankful that he is around. Now, the reason why I'm in this area is because I found male leopard tracks moving around on Vulture's Nest, Nyala Road South, which is all the areas that I was looking yesterday for Hosanna. But these tracks look far too big to be Hosanna. They are massive, almost looks the size of Tingana's track. So I'm not quite sure, but the tracks are not 100% fresh. They're not something that's just walked in this area. Unfortunately, they've gone a little bit crusty from the rain. So what happens when it rains and drizzles just a little bit like what we had earlier, it's enough just to make a hardened layer on the road. And the track itself, the edges get quite crusty. And so if you touch the edge and it doesn't just move straight away, you know that it was just before the rain. So it's not tracks that are that fresh, but they are heading in this general direction. So we might as well have a look and see if we can't find it. But I am with Byron on the sunset at the moment. It's just caught the corner of my eye because it's now just coming out on my left-hand side as well. But there it is. You can just see it starting to dip down. And when that sun comes down underneath those clouds, all these clouds should light up. We should get some really beautiful colors coming.